We're here today at somewhere pretty special. The Caterham Formula One factory. This has been abandoned since the team went under in 2015 and it's still here. I'm already getting post-apocalyptic vibes, lads. Mm. It is very, very much so. Walking around the edge, getting into here was a little bit sketchy. I feel like I've already seen a few open doors and a few smashed windows, so. Imagine we can't get in. <laughs> <laughs> we got out. Imagine if it just opened. Oh boy, here we go. Uh, <sighs> we found the back door. We're in. Torches on, boys and girls. Bro, this is so creepy. Look at that. Yeah, mad. Northamptonshire County Council. Someone's been here, but they haven't come back out. <laughs> hey, look, we have found the sim room, I think. Yeah, we think this is the sim room. We have this, there's some photos that we found and we think this is it. So there's cutouts on the floor, and you see it's almost like a little circular shape, and that's where the sim room would have been with the car exhaust system. I mean, got to do it, right? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't the door just open? <laughs> <laughs> I just assumed it'd be locked. Like, there's enough here. If a team wanted to come in and like build, uh, open this facility, you wouldn't have to knock down everything necessarily. So that, yeah, definitely. There it is. Look at that. A little bit run down at the moment. Not qu not quite as it looked in its glory days, but. Cheeky indoor karting track. You oh. could round it. You gotta make a bridge over the poo pool. Big area here, and then you just shoot off up there into the into the thick of it. Do you know what the best thing about Caterham is that Guido van der Gaal used to race with them. Like he was right here doing kick flips on that ramp. Guido, kick it. Hey. Seven. Do you reckon someone just kicked through this, or they wanted to leave this job so badly they nah, just people dove kick. through? I can't like, take this anymore. <laughs> oh, why are we always losing? <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, we can't go in. We don't have the swipe card. Is he got it? Is he, is he oh, yet? sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I do want to find a fire extinguisher that still works. I think that'd be quite cool. Oh, I heard a sound. I got my hopes up. I'm covering your six. Six is this way. I'm 28. What am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> they had no hopes for their 2014 season. It just says. AL on Monday the 3rd of February and then nothing else happened. I think the, their last race was just before the US Grand Prix. I don't think they even yes. made it. Remember, this factory was Arrows first before it mm -hmm. was Caterham. Okay. And it was Super Aguri as well. What? Come here. <laughs> oh. Oh, hello. You can bring Hannah a present home. <laughs> so this might have been where the chassis were. Yeah. Maybe like assembly or something. All of these documents still here. Right, I think this is where Caterham went wrong. Here's all about their hydraulic and systematic. Parts schematic. And parts. Systematic. <laughs> parts list. Big words. There's nothing, there's nothing in there. Oh. So that's probably where they went wrong. They didn't have any parts. Now we know why they went bust. It is sad though that this all went down in one day and this poor little jerry can did not make it. Trapped by the door. Hi, welcome <laughs> to Caterham. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what we've got today. <laughs> Look at that! Oh, it's definitely been leaking some stuff as well. Is this amazing? <laughs> Death. Death. Like, obviously, it's no MTC, but it's not a pokey little place. Like it's, it's got some height to it. Again, I think if a team took this over, like it looks pretty sound. You had all the departments, all the desks lined up here. This is so much bigger. That Kate room and this little pokey F1 team who didn't really achieve anything, yet it's still got a, such a massive facility. It just shows how much money you need to operate a team in F1. So the boss's office, this is the where the team principal would have been. He looks over where the cars would have been. I've seen that. I've seen... Sorry. Very subtle, mate. Very subtle. Carry on. So that is where the cars would have been. We're going to go down there, but yeah, not bad. Not bad. Damn. I just can't get over how much space there is. Yeah. And this is the small team as well. And it's just yeah, exactly. So and it's the smallest team in F1, like vacant. Mate, our first bit of memorabilia. Like <laughs> Kovalainen. Look. Likes pasta, sports, fast cars, and metal music. Ooh, it's like some cool little spaceship. This the ceiling's pretty much gone, so we've got some good lighting in here. But this wow. is pretty 
cool. Oh, this is like proper GCSE drama studio sort of esque. So this building is so big, like, I never imagined it to be this big. We got more Hakey Cobra line and stuff. Are we gonna get who was the other driver then? Yano Trudy, weren't it? <laughs> Poo. <laughs> Everything here is for one car or two cars. Everything here. Like, this is yeah. so much space and so many people, thousands of people in a by one thing. You're looking at that broken, smashed window and you're thinking, how did someone smash that? Did they climb up? And then you just see this rogue fire extinguisher, <laughs> which I rate the efforts of throwing it up there, to be fair. Whoa! Oh, oh it's broken. Oh, it. it is crazy to see how much has been destroyed. I mean, it's been abandoned since 2015-ish, something like that. So it's been a fair few years, but the amount of vandalism that's gone on and people just nicking like, there's nothing here. If you want to come here to try and get some memorabilia of the F1 team, you're getting a Haiti Cobra line and car, that's it. That's all that's left. We have found the pool. I don't know, seen better days, innit? The MTC pool and then the Catron pool. Yeah. Not quite on the same level, but... Wow. To be fair, it doesn't look like there's much in there, but I reckon it's still quite deep for you out there. I reckon there's some bodies in there. Yeah. So this was where they had lunch. This was like their cafeteria. And the kitchens were through there. I don't know if you can see as well. You can yeah. tell, look, there's a few meal deals about. Isn't it such a waste though? You look at this massive building, all the money that was invested putting into it, and it's just sitting here. Someone must have lost a lot of money through like all of this, like the way it is now. I've been swinging. Whoa, the fucking kitchen shit me up. <laughs> There's a bitch in the up there. <laughs> this is probably at the moment one of the coolest things we've seen. An office with an actual 20... that was like 2012 or 2013? It's signed. signed. Just in the entrance and there's two cars parked there. So, I, and I don't think there were two cars when we got here. It might be yeah. time to scarp up. But, I mean, look at that, it's just crazy. Imagine like jumping off here, diving into the pool. But two cars have arrived. So are they security? Are they just like us? Are they looking around or are we going to go to jail? Stay tuned to find out. Well, you won't find out because the video won't come out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look, you've got loads of moulds over here. Look, you can see here is Dave. This would be the top of the car. Headrest. The headrest, exactly. To anyone who would just walk up here, this is useless. This is junk, but to an F1 fan, you can pick out little bits of the car from here. And make your own cage from. You can. So these were like carbon fiber molds, this is where you put it in. You could get the shape of the car that you wanted through the arm pool. The exhaust system that's over there, you've got the headrest, different little bits, and this would all make one F1 car. You can see the gap. So here in this shed, you've got loads more molds, but it's interesting to see, it says Lotus there, Lotus F1, rather than the catering team. So these are old. Very old. Hmm. That'd be, what, what kind of years? 2010 to yeah. 2012, I think it was. I can't tell if there's anyone in the cars, but I haven't seen anyone yet, so we move. Oh my god, there it is. Yeah, this is from like 2010. Is that Tarbo? No. <laughs> <laughs> that was very dusty. Yeah. No, that's the that's the Lotus logo. Yeah, yeah, it's the Lotus logo, 2010, 2011. Yeah, that's mad, so that's not even Catron. I don't think we're going to be finding anything better than this today. It seems like this is the only thing left in this place. It's been completely abandoned and vandalised and everything's been stolen. But do you know what? I'm pretty happy with this find. That's the perfect place to end it, I think. So I hope you all enjoyed watching it. I've had a great day. I think. It's been good fun. It's, it's this been has been a great day. day. This has been day. nuts. I mean, this place is surreal. It's so cool. But yeah, live fast. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like the video. Plenty more content like this is coming. Don't you worry. Don't walk on uneven surfaces. Oh, <laughs> weird. Oh, Oops. Here. And expect others to report defects. Well, clearly, no one's reported this.